How's it, everyone? Welcome back. This is the Mac Coast to Coast Show. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe so you know when we go live. Here's your host, Brian McLamara. Welcome again to another fabulous episode of the Mac Coast to Coast Show. A show started by three cousins living across the coasts to bind together one fabulous dream for many fabulous nights. Now, I know some of you kids out there have been thinking, have I been naughty or nice? Santa Claus is coming up and you better be good because I'm here with my co-hosts, Raz. Hey, it's funny you should say that. I threw out the Santa Claus mustache or beard for tonight. Well, you got 30 days. And T-Mac. What's up, everybody? Welcome to the show. It's going to be a great show this week. Uh, before we get started, let's go ahead and thank our sponsors. They're the ones that keep the lights on around here. Brotherhood 808, where your friends are your chosen family. And are you ready to brand your business so you can keep the lights on? Then you better give the guys at Brand Ready Media a call. They'll help you out. Well, guys, how was your Thanksgivings? Oh, it was awesome, man. Had a great time. Cooked the turkey in a crock pot this year. It came out perfect. Awesome. Raz, how about you? Um, I had to work, but uh, it was okay. Uh, other than my work was supposed to have turkey dinner for us, and when I got there, all they had was mashed potatoes. <laughs> no turkey? Brutal. <laughs> yeah, the lady's like, oh, we have some mashed potatoes. I was like, oh, uh, okay. What am I going to do? Yeah, you didn't Shape throw it th into a turkey form or something? <laughs> it's like the Wonder Twins. Pretty Shape disappointing. Shape of. <laughs> but other than that, it was good. Thank you. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. Didn't mean to <clears throat> rub salt in the wound there. No, not a big deal. Normally, I bring my dinner to work, and I didn't that night because I was expecting a free meal. and Didn't mean to peel uh, that Band-Aid off. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. You know, I had a... Tis what it is. I had a very memorable Thanksgiving many, many years ago when I was uh, in the Army National Guard. We had Thanksgiving uh, at the at the unit, and they had a big dinner. And I showed up late with my date. Uh, and so they made me hang out in the kitchen the whole time. And I had to clean pots and pans while all the guys kept my date warm. Wow. Kept her cozy. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Luckily, it was brutal, more dude. than that. <laughs> it was brutal. You know how those army dudes all cooped up in the barracks can be. Luckily, you got her back. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's a, something to thanks, give thanks for, right? Right. Yeah. You got his Wayne back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, goodness. Wow. Great Thanksgiving stories. Yeah. Well, tonight we have a special guest, Denise Kroll, longtime friend of mine. She was a massage therapist. She decided to give Thrive a try and also found the Lord about the same time and is doing really well. And now she's opening up her own uh, wellness studio on the Panhandle up in Pensacola, Florida. Welcome, Denise. Welcome, Denise. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Nice to have you on. Thanks so much for having me. This is really cool. I'm excited. We're excited to have you. So, what's it like down, where are you, in, in the panhandle of Florida there? I am. I have been here since 05, and uh, it's it's home to me now. Um, obviously, I grew up in Winter Haven, Florida, and uh, moved all over the place and landed my roots here in the panhandle, and it's, I love it. You guys have to come visit. A little chilly up there right now, huh? I know, it is. Up here in the Panhandle, it gets pretty cold. Um, it's supposed to get in the 30s. If I moved to Florida and it got in the 30s, I would feel gypped. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. On the contract, it says it doesn't get below 55, I know, when you come across the border there. Denise, tell us a little bit about yourself. You know, just getting started here so people know a little bit more about you and 
you know, kind of where you're headed and stuff like uh -huh. that. Yeah, it's like, where do I start, right? So um, I am um, a massage therapist and I ha I'm also an entrepreneur. I have a, a cloud-based business, um, which is the Thrive Experience. But um, um, as you can see, that's what's on my arm. It's the wearable nutrition. But to back up, um, I guess, you know, I knew Raz and everybody back in Winter Haven grew up there and I um, moved out of town gosh lived in Hawaii for a little while graduated I could write a book but I don't know how far back you want me to go but um, played soccer all my life I've always been an athlete um, ended up uh, playing soccer in college and uh, won a national championship but uh -huh also found out that I was um, 15 and a half weeks pregnant uh, two weeks before we were going to the national championship wow. so Raz remembers all that mm -hmm. um, and uh, anyway long story short there um, I have a beautiful daughter now and uh, I was thinking about getting on here Raz and I wish I could find it but I have that picture of you laying in my mom's um, house on the floor, holding on to Jasmine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And like, she's, uh, she got what, the coach of the year or something down there? Or she's a rock I forget star. what conference she's in, but she's yeah. a volleyball coach, right? Yes. Um, she kind of followed in my footsteps, but not in soccer, um, volleyball. And mm. uh, she actually played D1 on a full ride scholarship at Southern Miss. And uh, she's came back home to where we are here and she has coached at her uh, high school for five years now and 10 years ago she got player of the year and just uh, on Thanksgiving day we found out that she got um, coach of the year so awesome. that's kind of mm -hmm. cool but uh, um, get out of here you <laughs> have a daughter who's coach of the year I was thinking like your daughter was like five or six no, really? and she's about to make me a grandmama. So she is. Get uh, out of here. Any any moment, right? On the baby? Yes. Yeah, Grandbaby, I should say. Is she having a boy or girl? You know? Yes. Lexi Grace is my granddaughter. She's about to enter this Internet. world very soon. So. Well, congratulations. That's Thank awesome. Well, thanks yeah, for congrats. taking the time to come to see us. You know, I know you're. You know, busy woman at the moment. You're also starting a uh, wellness center, right? Yes. So um, I've been licensed as a massage therapist since 97. And when I moved here to the Panhandle, I was not actually doing massage. But um, in 06, I decided that I needed to get back into it. It was my passion. And so I did. I took that leap of faith and started my practice in 06 here was um, very successful. Um, I actually, being an athlete, I do more sports uh, related, you know, take you out of pain, keep you out of pain, no frou-frou massages here. Uh, in 09, I started this, um, I learned a technique called cranial release, and that really changed my practice. And I can tell you about that in a minute if you want me to, but um, then in 05, um, I was 45 and literally, not 05, sorry, um, 2015, my um, business was thriving, uh, massage business was thriving, and but I was really honestly um, a big hot mess and I was um, waking up tired and exhausted, I was waking up hurting, my hands were starting to, you know, deteriorate with, you know, just doing so much hard work mm -hmm. um you know 45 years old as a woman you know we go through that fun time in our lives and just you know i just came to a point in my life that i um had kind of lost myself but being a single mom and a um, massage therapist with a you know great business i didn't have time to <laughs> be you know, uh, sad and broken and hurting. So I was kind of just living behind a smile and just, you know, 
you know, do what I do best and, you know, go help other people. And um, I was kind of trying to pour from an empty cup. And I really honestly was just, um, you know, super blessed. Um, my, my goodness, super blessed. But I uh, found myself just in a rut. And I, um, I guess I sh could back up and start talking about um, finding Jesus in 2013. I know you wanted to talk about that, uh, Rad. Yeah, yeah. Well, that was that was kind of uh, beginning of the change, and then you found Thrive as well. So I don't mean to just jump yeah. into your story, but that's that's awesome. And I've noticed so much of a difference. I mean, not not that I noticed that you were uh, you know anything wrong with you back in the day, but I've noticed just your enthusiasm, your energy, um, just your love of life, I guess, and. Uh, you know, it's it's a good thing to see, and I love when my friends uh, are happy. So that makes me really happy, you know. Yes, absolutely. And I've always been that, you know, spirit. You know, I feel like I've always been that way. But um, you know, through all my obstacles in life as a single mom at 23, um, I just, um, you know, just kept, you know, trudging through and all those obstacles and. Um, you know, to get on that subject a little bit, I remember um, when Jasmine was, tw gosh, no, she was about six months old. I have a picture back in the, the day with my permed hair and I got all dressed up to go to church because I even felt that nudge back then, but it just, um, I, I just, it wasn't the right time, I guess. And I, I've always been very positive and, you know, um, just, you know, trying to figure life out, I guess you could say. And, you know, I, I went to church that day and took her to church. Obviously, you know, Sundays growing up, my mom, you know, we went to play soccer. And so her raising us as a single mom, you know, Sundays were for soccer, not church. But I can always look back and know that, you know, she always, you know, taught us those Christian morals and values. Um, but I, you know, was always afraid of it and thinking that I needed to know how to, you know, you know, say scriptures and, and memorize all this stuff and um, come to find out in 2013, uh, I was invited to go to church on Easter Sunday. So um, Jasmine and I went to church on Easter Sunday, right? That's when you go, you know, Easter, Christmas, you know. Right. Yeah. And um, this is a great story because we went that day and this was a time where I was in that, you know, funk I was just talking about. And uh, at the end of the um, sermon, he, you know, he does the Lord's Prayer and asks, you know, whoever... Um, months to accept Christ into their life, raise your hand. And unbeknownst to either one of my, me or Jasmine, we both raised our hands simultaneously. Wow. And it was just such a God awesome moment. And then, so that was April of 2013. We both got baptized in the Gulf of Mexico together. Um, and then, you know, I still found myself, um, you know, in that funk, but I learned very quickly that, you know, how to, you know, have a relationship with Jesus and, and knowing that it's simple, you know, you just have to talk to him. And, and um, in 2015, when I was in that position uh, of just trying to pour from that empty cup, I, you know, kind of just had a, a meltdown and just was like, you know, praying for something to come into my life to work smarter, not harder. And, and really, I just, it, very vivid. Uh, one Saturday after working my whole, you know, weeks of just um, pouring into others and helping others, um, I, I just had a breakdown and just fell to my knees and, you know, arms up in the air and tears, lots of tears and prayer and saying, I can't do this anymore. And that was uh, about two weeks later when Markel, um, that you know, uh, mm -hmm. called me on a Friday night. I'll never forget it. And she said, hey, girl, have you ever heard of Thrive? And that's when... I was like, no, what is it? And she told me a little bit about it. And I said, hey, if it makes me feel just a little bit better than I do right now, it's a win. And um, so I always tell people, you, you know, you, you need a whole lot of Jesus and a, a little bit of Thrive and your life 
can change. <laughs> well, that's a great that's time a good... to, for me to ask you a question about it. You know, can you tell me a little bit about what Thrive is and, uh, yeah. you know, with you feeling, you know, what it, what the experience was like for you and, and how you felt after you started it? I'd like to hear about it for our listeners. Yeah, absolutely. So, um, you know, again, back to, you know, always being an athlete, always pretty being pretty much healthy, always taking supplements and, and trying my best to be healthy um, and being, I used to be a personal trainer as well. So, um, you know, no stranger to supplementation, no stranger to how to work out and, and do all the right things. But, you know, life gets in the way, right? And at the time I was taking probably 15 different supplements and um, I was doing it because I knew that I wasn't eating everything that I needed, so I needed to supplement. And so um, I was always looking for the next best thing, but I was never consistent on those 15 things. Um, and so when she shared it with me and told me how simple it was, um, I, I was like, let's do it. So Thrive is a nutritional supplement. It is, it's super simple. It's three steps that you take within the first 20 minutes of your morning. And it's, it's one product, but it's broken down into three formula or three different steps. And so, um, actually I have it with me right here. So I can I was about to say, yeah, 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 let's check it out. Let's do a so, plug, man. It might so be a sponsor yeah. one day. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> um, I'm a proud thriver, um, and won't go a day without it. It's been almost six years, but so this is, um, the women's capsules and we have a men's formula as well um and basically you wake up in the morning and you take two capsules before you get out of bed in the morning uh 20 minutes later you're going to mix and drink uh your lifestyle mix we have six different flavors it is a vitamin shake and it's uh full of all your gut health your pre and probiotics and digestive enzymes I mix mine with water, you can mix it with milk, and you just drink it down, get it in your system, and then you put on your Dermafusion technology, which obviously this is which one I'm wearing. We do have several different um, kinds. It, it looks like a patch, right? But it's called Dermafusion technology. Here's another one that we have, and that's it. So within the first 20 minutes of your morning, you're done with those three steps, and you go about your day. And the day I started that, I was like, did they forget to send me something? That's so simple, right? Yeah, and, yeah. Um, you know, of course I was intrigued with the dermal patch, right? Because, you know, before I knew about this, you know, you see all the other patches for, for pain or, you know, hormonal patches, obviously no smoking patches. So I was extremely intrigued with that um, dermal patch with, you know, all those ingredients are going straight through my skin. So obviously the absorption has to be pretty high. So um, that was, you know, my day one of taking Thrive and, um, you know, really all it's doing is filling in your individual nutritional gaps because again, you know, you can eat, uh, it doesn't matter, you know, how good you eat or not. Um, you can never give your body everything that it needs nutritionally um, with food alone, especially with our, you know, soil and, you know, foods, you know, definitely not nutrient um, dense like it used to be, right? And then, of course, all the GMO and um, chemical filled. All the good stuff. Chemical filled. The stuff we grew up on. Yeah. I should probably get that, you know. I, my diet consists of 95% macaroni and cheese and then whatever else falls in the <laughs> that I can get off the kitchen floor. Yeah. So but you know what the great thing is, is people are, people tell me all the time, oh, well, I'm, I'm not an athlete. I don't work out. I don't need that. I'm like, no, you're human. Your body needs nutrition. <laughs> and the great thing is, is you can still eat macaroni and cheese <laughs> off the floor. Well, and that's what... and you'll oh, feel <laughs> thank God. You know, I was, yeah. People ask me all the time, like, you know, what about drinking, you know, whatever, you know, I'm like, look, you know, it's just filling in your gaps for the day. I'm not perfect by any means. Um, but I know every day that I do this product that um, my body's getting what it needs. And so, I mean, I went from being just tired, exhausted, hurting all the time, um, not sleeping well because of my discomfort in my shoulders. And being, I guess you could say sad um, because of lots of things in life were happening to me 
to um, full of energy, clean energy. And um, three days in, my, my joints weren't hurting anymore. And that was a huge win for me with, you know, being a massage therapist. And then about 10 days in, I had, you know, lost that fun belly fat that we women, you know, get. And um, I woke up that morning about 10 days in, you know, and had the best sleep of my life. And it, it truly gave me my happy back. And, you know, wow. people are like, how the heck does your vitamins do that for you? But um, I can't. I just ordered some myself yesterday. Hey, is it expensive? Old, right? <laughs> what does it cost? Yeah, see, it's already working. It, it, it's amazing. It, it really is. Um, yeah, we'll hook you up because I'm telling you that, um, you know, I'll, I'll never stop taking this product. Um, I've never missed a day in almost six years. It has truly changed my life. It's, um, you know, and I'll, I tell people all the time, I'm like, it's, it's vitamins and nutrition, but it's so much more than that. You know, we have, you know, story after story of story of people of how it's helping and obviously we can't make any medical claims but um, it's just pure plant-based nutrition and there's no synthetics and fillers and you know there is definitely a difference between you know your your vitamins whether you're taking them over the counter um, and thrive Plus, <laughs> uh, you've done pretty well I always see you on uh, you know the the socials um, you know you're off in Mexico and you're off in Vegas and it's like yeah. Oh, where's she going this time? I mean, it's the craziest thing. And I'll share that a little bit with you guys. Because, I mean, I did not get into this to do a business. I mean, when I started this, I was doing six to eight deep tissue massages four days a week. The, the last thing I had was time, right? But what I realized is when I started doing this product, I had so much more energy. I was so happy, much happier. I mean, I had more time. And we're a cloud-based business. And um, I actually came in as a promoter because it's absolutely free to promote our product. And even our customers can thrive for free, which is, again, crazy. And so when I was first told that, that I can either order as a customer, refer to friends and get my product for free, or come in as a promoter, get my product for free, um, but refer those by referring those two people. But the only difference was I was getting a paycheck on Tuesday. And I was like, what? That's like kind of a no brainer. Like I'm thinking of way more than two people right now. And, you know, I found out that there was no risk. I didn't have to, you know, you know, if I decided I didn't like it, then, you know, I can tap out and I'm not like stuck in anything. I mean, I'm not skeptical, but once they started telling me that I was like, you know, asking lots of questions. And so long story short, um, got on the product, I already shared what it did with, you know, within a few days um, and how it really helped me, you know, through my crazy busy days um, and really truly changed my life. I couldn't shut up about it. And here I am six years later and I you can't, still can't shut up about it. <laughs> I mean, I think I think that's great. You know, a long time ago, I used to sell water uh, water purifiers, and yeah. they, the guy, the guys, like it was like I was in some crazy Kirby salesman class. Like the guys at the front of the room, and there's like tables with like tons of dudes in there, and they're like, "Jump on in, the water's fine, bro. Just buy like <laughs> you buy like seven of them, and then you gotta sell them." And then like you know, there's a guy next to me, he's like, "I've got a whole garage full of them." And I'm like, nobody's talking about actually selling them. They're just buying them. Yeah. So um, I wanted to ask you a question about it. Like for somebody like me, you know, active surfing, doing stuff like that. Um, I went through, is it, does it make you jittery? Is it like an energy drink? Do you, Cause I, I'm scared of all that kind of stuff. Cause I've had an experience with, I was hooked on energy drinks. I was telling Raz and them about it earlier. Yeah. I uh, I used to drink one in the morning before I surf a monster, monster Java, and then I would go to work all tired, and then I'd drink another one, and then through the years of doing that, I had to go to the hospital because my heart was messing up, you know, like missing beats. So I was just wondering, like, is it like does it make you jittery? I know Raz really enjoyed taking it before, yeah. and I, I just wondered, like, is it? Does it, it's all natural, you say? I, I was reading the ingredients in it, and it sounds pretty cool. Yeah. Just, you know. No, I totally understand how you feel, um, for sure. And uh, what people, um, what, 
to explain it is yes it's all natural it's all plant-based but you know the synthetic caffeine that's out there on the market right in the energy yeah. drink even a lot of caf uh coffee right so you get that high and what happens you get the crash so then you got to drink mm. it again and then you got to do this right so that's that's synthetic caffeine um you can you can even google um, coffee and um, I've seen an article that one cup of coffee had over 300 chemicals in it um, yeah. so that that jittery if you feeling, get the good stuff <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> that, that jittery CBD. yeah that, that CBD jittery coffee is that synthetic right and yeah. unfortunately um, there's a lot of big companies that are you know benefiting from making things look cool with their marketing and it's really killing our society, um, especially our young people with those energy drinks. But so Thrive is a nutritional supplement and everything it has is, you know, like the Ferrari of nutrition. And um, we have, um, so it's combined with, in, in those three steps, you're not just getting, you know, the green or, you know, black coffee bean, but there's a hundred vitamins and nutrients I mean everything your body needs in those three steps so it's um, it's it's pure grade you're not gonna get jittery you're gonna feel this really good clean happy energy that's gonna sustain throughout the the whole day um, that's awesome yeah yeah because I know Raz is Raz is just talking about it the other day he misses it because he's you know we're getting older dude we're losing our or you know our drive that we once had so it sounds like maybe i should jump on it too <laughs> yeah i took a break from it for financial reasons um and uh i actually did it for a couple of years there and i loved it but i ended up taking one pill a day because uh it just gave me so much energy i was doing leg lifts in my bed before <laughs> before going to sleep <laughs> Which well, I had some nice, uh, a nice six pack going, but, but I mean, when I was ready to sleep, I could sleep. That was the thing, but um, right. it just gave me like, I was amazed. And sometimes I would work a 12 and a half hour shift. I'd come home, I'd take the other one and I'd drive to Alabama to go hunt. And the guys are like, dude, you've been up all day. I'm like, yeah, man, only got one more hour to go. <laughs> and they're like, all right, dude, whatever. But, uh. I mean, we have, I'll tell you this, my daughter's pregnant and the doctor approved it. So, you know, obviously we can't make those claims, but, um, you know, I I'm, I'm an advocate for, um, I'm reading a book right now, Vegication Over Medication. It, this is a good chance for you to uh, kind of tell our viewers and our listeners right now how they can become a thriver and maybe explain to them where they can go to find your product. Yes, you know, absolutely. Um, well, um, obviously, you know, we are a cloud-based business and um, everything is online and they just really go through um, a, um, a link. But, um, you know, oh, look at you guys. But is this Raz, your website? Raz, what is, um, we, we want to we wanna give Raz's um, link, but, uh, or mine, it doesn't matter, but... Uh, you know, so the the DMC three one one seven dot Lavelle dot com, but uh, so it's pronounced Thrive Lavelle, not Level, right? I mean, I was kind of tripping on that. So they basically just Google that, and they can find out how to get started. Well, we can um, put my link or even Raz's link. You know, Raz, do you know your link? I think it was Raz nine one one with an extra one, so Raz nine one one one. Yeah. So awesome. So I can, I'll find out before we get off here and I, uh, we can post that if you have a way of posting it. Um, yeah, we'll post great. it in, the, we'll post it in the comments section here sure. at the video. And, uh, basically you would just get in touch with myself or Raz and, or, you know, I know, um, I know a lot more about it. So I, you know, you can contact me, but we'll use Raz's link for sure. Oh. Um, and, and that's how we yeah, do it. Yeah, so I can get some free yeah. stuff. Yeah, so <laughs> yeah, explain yeah, that free, real quick. Free, so, free, free. Yeah, a lot of people, yeah. you know, a lot of people are like, you know, and you even mentioned it, Raz, you know, financial situation. So our product's $5 a day, okay? Maybe up to seven if you choose a different um, patch that might be a little bit more. But to me, 5 to $7 a day for your health and what you're getting with this product is not expensive. Right. But if you 
refer to friends as a customer, you get your product for free every month. And that's my job as a promoter is to help my customers um, thrive for free. But if you think about it, most people are spending way more than five to seven dollars a day on things they don't need, like those energy drinks. Starbucks. Starbucks. You know, people, yeah. I was spending well over three hundred dollars a month. I have not had coffee in almost six years. Um, cool. I have not, you know, really bought anything from Starbucks. I mean, I just I don't buy over the counter vitamins anymore. I don't buy them online anymore. So between Starbucks, I mean, if I wanted coffee right now, I could drink it, but what's it going to do to me? It's going to give me that cr high and then crash, right? And, yeah, yeah. Why and that's where I'm at. I mean, the first time I took it, I, not to interrupt you, I'm sorry, but uh, I quit drinking Mountain Dew. I was, I drank Mountain Dew my whole life, you know, and um, I'm so and look ashamed at that I. Dude, our fridge back in the day was nothing but. <laughs> Mountain Dew two liters squished. When I'm ashamed now that I know how bad it is for you. I was just drinking it like water, you know, it's like, uh, it's horrible. And now I've, you know, now I'm up to, uh, two or three cups of coffee a day. So I'm like, you know, it's time to do something, you know, so, and I work nights too. So it's, uh, gotta have something man sometimes to change the subject but i kind of wanted to hear about what you're massaging you said you do cranial massages now or something what's that all about yeah i could use one i'm looking up uh raz's uh thing real quick oh okay here it is so his link is it's actually your link is just um oh wait do you get a case of Mountain Dew when you order with Raz? <laughs> no, that's our sponsor <laughs> next week. So his it. <laughs> his uh, link is just razmclamera.lavelle.com, and it's l-e-v-e-l.com. Okay, so, sweet. So well, I can guys get on and get come get see Raz me. hooked up. Hey, yeah. why don't you? Why don't you post it in the chat, and then that way I can copy and paste it, and I can oh, use it to yeah, put in the promo. I'm technically challenged. Where do I do that? <laughs> Man, you got me. I just figured out how to do this much. Well, I, this is as far well, as I got. Well, <laughs> and what is it? MCCL? Yep. M-C-C-L-A-M-A-R-A. -A -A. No, it's M-C-L-A. M -A -R. Why do you say M C C? No, I don't even know my damn name. <laughs> damn. <laughs> Golly. How am I ever going to be famous? <laughs> oh my gosh. I felt it. Joe Biden over second. here. Second. Yeah, really. <laughs> We're just going to have to change our names Joe, again. Uh, M C Mac. Uh, obviously, I need some bribe. There you go. <laughs> Anyway, okay. back to the cranial massage. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So cranial release. So I do cranial release before I actually start the massage. Cranial release takes just a couple minutes and it feels like I'm stretching your neck uh, or your trapezius muscles and maybe even your rhomboids. So it literally is rebooting all your systems of the body. It is taking your central nervous system out of fight or flight, which is a stress syndrome, um, and allowing the body to naturally heal. It's releasing all the cranial bones at one time, but in layman's terms, I like to tell people it's just rebooting all your systems of the body. And, um, you know, unrelieved stress, whether it be emotional, mental, physical stress, uh, can cause pain or disease. And when you actually um, you know, think about your brain all the time working, overloading, right? Emotionally, mentally, physically, just stressed out. And um, Especially in 2020, right? We're all kind of yeah. in that world right now. So, yeah. A lot of stress, a lot of financial stress, a lot of just stress period, you know, so it must feel good. Yes. And so it takes you to that state of relaxation you can't do on your own. And then, um, I mean... It, most people come to me for physical, you know, ailments that they're hurting their neck, their back, whatever. And, um, but, you know, the cranial release will help, you know, everything. And I always like to share this one story is uh, I have a nephew that's type 1 diabetic. And I gave him a cranial release after he gave himself his first shot. 
and the cranial release regulated his blood sugar to where he didn't have to shoot three shots of insulin. So wow. Wow. get out of here. Mm -hmm. So it, That's I mean, I've had people either. tell me that they no longer have migraines. They no longer have the discomforts, you know, in their neck. Um, I've had, you know, I mean, I could go on and on and on people that are going to doctors or PTs and for six months and can't get any relief and within a two minute treatment um, can move their neck more and no longer have the, the migraines. Um, it, it's it, like I said, in 09, it changed my life and, uh, you know, changed my practice as well, mainly. And, um, you know, that's really where I just really started getting really su successful. But um, believe it or not, um, you know, I actually walked away from my massage practice and uh, was only doing the Thrive Experience um, for three and a half years before I got another God nudge in October of last year. And that's when I am starting my wellness center. So. Okay. That's very exciting. Tell us about that wellness center. <laughs> Yeah, so, which is really cool because I never, ever, ever thought that I'd be able to walk away from my massage practice, but God kind of led me in a different way with the Thrive Experience and, you know, healing people's bodies from, you know, from within with nutrition. And, um, you know, in October of uh, last year, uh, God nudged me again and said, I'm, you know, not done with you yet. And um, I really wanted to go into real estate investment, and that's what I was kind of thinking I was going to do. And uh, it just kind of happened to where I had a bunch of people starting to call me and say, hey, um, are you doing massage still? And, you know, hey, I got a, my neck's hurting. And it was just weird how it happened. I shouldn't say weird. I, I know it was all God because... All of a sudden, um, next thing I know is I'm doing more massages uh, than I was, and um, I ended up buying a building in October of last year, and it's taking forever because I'm renovating it, um, completely gutting it, and you know, getting con you know contractors and permits and all that kind of stuff. But it, um, the name of the, the building came available, the finances came available, the name, the, um, the name of my wellness center is going to be Revive Wellness, Mind, Body, Soul. And it's just been a really cool God thing. You know, I'm, I, I guess I like to try to control things, but then if I, you know, my favorite saying is let go, let God. And, you know, he's going to show you a plan for your life that it, I never, ever, ever imagined this for my, for my life. Um, you know, I wouldn't be able to do this without him, obviously, but I definitely wouldn't be able to do it without what the Thrive Experience and the company Lavelle has done for me. And, um, you know, to think that I'm buying commercial, you know, real estate and, you know, doing what I'm getting ready to do. And so the, the wellness center will have obviously massage, my cranial release. Um, another really cool thing is uh, when I bought the building and decided to take that leap of faith, and, and listen to that God nudge. Um, I had no idea, but um, my daughter actually decided to go to esthetician school. So she's coming on board as soon as she can after she has this baby and she will be my esthetician, but she's gonna also be my manager and my marketing person and do all my social media marketing. And um, this will really kind of be her baby. So I'm able to you know, set her up for success and work for herself. So, that's awesome so. such a positive story that's why i wanted to have you on because you know i mean i've watched you from afar and uh, i know you helped out your niece and everything and mm -hmm. um you've just been doing really well so i wanted to have you on because it's a positive story Aww. and i love you oh, i love you too and i'm so i'm um, thank group you hugs. <laughs> <laughs> that's I'll, our that's I'll our group hugs on every every podcast Yes, I'll be in Winter Haven at the end of January for a wedding, so I'll make sure that we connect. All right. I appreciate you taking the time to come be and be on the show and hang out and tell us about your story. It's awesome. Thank you. And I'm, I'm happy for you. What's the future hold for you? What's the future? The future for me? Um, What's the future? 
Oh gosh, you know, now that I've done this, I mean, my audacious faith of big dreams, right? You have to, you have to dream big. And um, I, where I bought my building is like a, an association and there's two other buildings in there and there's four other lots and oh. none of it is for sale. Land Baron. But uh, my, my, my plan and audacious faith is to own the others. Um, one will actually be a juice bar, smoothie bar, you know, healthy cafe. The other one will be, um, you know, yoga studio, um, you know, fitness area. And uh, just to uh, grow, <laughs> right? Just to keep yeah, growing, right? Yeah, I love it. To grow it. And uh, yeah, I mean, sounds you know, like you're on the right track. You know, you just keep working at what you're doing. You sound like it's going to be successful. Yeah, I mean, you know, if, I don't know. It's just been really fun and exciting and, you know, a lot of stress comes along with it. But, you know, I it's all good stuff, you know. Um, I, I People like want to hang out with you if you have that good feeling, that good, they call it mana in Hawaii. If you have a good mana, a good air aura to you, you know, you bring that. People want to come, you know. Right. So that's what will yeah. make your business be successful is the, you know, people wanting to just come see you and get that positive vibe. And that's really what it's all about. That's what that's what will make it be successful as you, you know, in your yeah. spirit. Loving, loving people, being kind. I mean, so many people are struggling right now. And, and to me, you know, I I'll share this. Um, one thing is when I was going through some difficult times in my life, um, I had this wise woman tell me, Denise, I know you're going through tough times right now, but throw your problems into a hat with everybody else in the world. And I promise you that you're going to pull yours right back out because there's so many people in this world struggling right now. So just remember that. Um, and that's something I share with people all the time. You know, um, we all are going through things, but if you can look at, you know, the, the positive of it and, and know that, you know, those struggles that you're going through right now are just, you're, you're just right on the other, you know, just about to go over that hump and you're going to be able to look back to that and know that you had to go through those struggles to get to where you are. So that was always just something that has stuck with me through these years and um, just be grateful for what we have because, you know, you know, we we're not promised tomorrow. True. That's right. True. Amen. You know, yeah. everything ch everything changes. Nothing ever stays the same. So when it's real bad, mm -hmm. it's not going to stay bad forever. That's right. Right. That's right. And you know Brian what? Max words live by. B Max. Man, I've been I've been living that I've been living that dream for like That's twenty years. Max facts. Max facts. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess we're gonna wrap it up, Denise. But like I said, we're blessed to have you on, and you know that positive energy you admit is just awesome and um we wish you the best and good luck on the the little grandbaby coming up yeah and congratulations so you have no idea how excited i am because obviously you know i was 23 and young and uh, you know um struggling to to be a mom so you know now i get to just sit back and enjoy right yeah right. So well, you'll see pictures as soon as she allows me to to post them <laughs> Ooh, awesome uh, Happy yes. holidays to you and your family, too. Thank you, you as well. Thank you guys so much. I really appreciate you guys, and uh, this has been fun. Awesome. Yeah, awesome. Well, th thanks for being on the show. Everybody, thanks for listening in. This is the Mac Coast to Coast Show. I'm B Max, signing out. <laughs> <laughs> <All right. Bye. laughs>